guys it's Sunday I can't even say good morning right now because I'd be lying to you that it's in the morning it's basically almost 2 p.m. I have been fighting with my laptop trying to um, uh, actually just put my videos onto YouTube and another one on Instagram and basically over Saturday Sunday I have lost two videos because technology is not cooperating with me so um, I'm super stressed because uh, it's taken a while to do these videos and now I basically don't have anything and this is what's happening there's absolutely nothing it's been telling me that nothing is selected so uh, just while I think if I let it sink it could um, kind of give me something so I was doing that I was thinking I can do like a quick Sunday skin therapy it's a Sunday um, I've already cleaned my house. Um, I'll do a cleaning with me vlog soon, but um, I'm going to go and take care of my skin and just give my computer some time to maybe try and find the stuff that I've lost. So yeah, let's go get the skin care done this Sunday. Hopefully I feel better for that crap. So these are basically all the products I've decided to use today. Um, my use of products like for a pamper day really depends on what I need and today this is what I'm in need of I need a little bit of clay because my skin is a little bit greasy right now and my pores are too visible and then after the clay I'm gonna put on something hydrating to rebalance I have my sponge right there which is gonna do a little bit of exfoliation and then I'll be using my bare minerals blemish remedy and this one has about 1% salicylic acid so um, even though I'm on Accutane it's not really gonna have that much adverse effect on me but to balance it out I'm going to be using my milky jelly cleanser from Glossier just to kind of soothe my skin and just recondition it. I have my jade roller which is like my trusted item when it comes to deep puffing my face and then once I take um, my Solal Collagen Plus Skin Essential pills every once a week uh, because I don't like to take vitamins every day. I feel like my body should use what I eat to give me um, nutrients and vitamins. I have a toner, I have um, a thermal spray there and then I have the Rose Facial Spray by Maribadesh which is nice and cooling with this heat I'm gonna need it and I've spoken to you guys about how much I love this spray so I'll be using that as well I have this sponge and I bought it from um, this was from uh, Forever 21 they have nice little facial tools and stuff this one does a little bit of exfoliation I need a little bit of exfoliation because my skin is a little bit clogged at the moment and just because it's self-care Sunday I'll be using I'll be doing dry brushing on my skin to open up my pores on my body and this is something I do once a week um, and I love to do this because it makes my skin very nice and smooth and um, everything just glides onto my skin perfectly and for scrubbing my body today I'm stepping away a little bit away from my own uh, products and I picked up this one from um, this scam is a sea salt uh, body scrub I like sea salt because it really deep cleanses skin and I really enjoy the feeling after a good cold shower so I'm gonna be using this one uh, to scrub my body today so yeah let's do this skincare therapy thing I'm going to start with some cold water because I just did some serious cardio in the shower okay like this routine on Sunday makes me too so tired you see I'm even sweating I have to like squat and <laughs> scrub my body from head to toe it's like a lot I'm just rehydrating and cooling my body down. So I have already, why do I feel like I'm zoomed in? I have already uh, washed my face. Well, my first step of cleansing has already been done in the shower. So now I'm going to do the second one, which will be with my Glossier uh, Milky Jelly Cleanser. And uh, like I said, this is just to basically, um, to condition my skin because the cleanser I used first is quite, um, it has acid in it. So I need to just kind of bring my face back to just be having some gentleness. I think I wanna close the window. So I'm filming with natural light, things will change and move around. I didn't wanna plug in all those lights. It looks like that. And that's just like the way it feels on my skin. It feels a little bit oily and tacky. So it feels good on skin. So I'm going to start with that.
let's just think of this as me practicing to film for vogue <laughs> and as i always say guys i don't really use face gloss to wipe my face uh if i'm not using these from forever 21 i'm using this which i got from woolies and it keeps my skin nice and clean so i'm just gonna grab one of these and i'm just gonna use it to dab my face you see i'm not swiping I'm just dabbing for now. Maybe I'll swipe when I'm taking off the mask because I use this to take off my mask. Next, I'm going to begin with my clay mask and I'm using this one by a French brand. This one is called Agiltez and it's basically a clay mask. And um, my cheek area, like right there, is kinda, the pores are a little too obvious and uh, it gets a little bit greasy lately, which is surprising because Accutane is supposed to have stopped that but that hasn't stopped so I am just gonna use a little bit of clay right there on my forehead, my nose and just right here so I, I don't feel it's necessary for me to apply clay where I don't need it so um, this is when multi-masking is very important and knowing the areas on which you need what. So if you have combination skin, I'm sure you're very familiar with doing this just on the areas where you're, you're oily because the rest of my face is a little dry, especially here. So I don't really need um, to put any clay there. So if I put, had to put clay there, it's actually gonna be a little bit dry. I recently posted, and I, I hope you saw, you don't have to keep your clay mask on until it's completely dry because it actually dries you up. I've actually spoken about this in another one of my videos. I'm gonna try and link as many skincare videos to this video that I've done in the past so that you guys can see. So I'm just gonna wait for this to uh, dry a little bit uh, or get tacky or muddy and then I'm gonna uh, wash it off. So I'll be right back. So my clay is exactly as I need it to be, so I'm going to be uh, rinsing this off. So it's not so dry, you see. So right now is the time for me to take it off. I shouldn't let it get any drier than this. So let me wash this off. So I have a little bit of a last minute decision. Uh, I'm going to be putting on a collagen mask because my skin has been a bit dull lately. Uh, it's not as bright and as... Um, glowy as I'd like it to be. So I'm gonna put on a little bit of a collagen mask and this one is from um, Mario Badescu. So I'm gonna be putting on a little bit of this mask because I really just need it. And um, it hydrates and smooths dry skin, dark complexion in need of a lift. This formula is designed to help improve skin's elasticity, featuring collagen to plump and smooth lines while delivering essential moisture to reveal a firmer, smoother, more youthful looking complexion. I'm definitely in need of that. So I have some on the lid that I'm gonna use. It, uh, it's a bit thick. It's not a thin mask and um, it almost feels like a clay mask. Well, it's not a clay mask, but that's how it feels to me. And um, I'm just gonna apply it. I'm gonna apply this one all over my face though, because it's, it's not drying. I'm just working it in because it's actually really thick. It says apply a thin layer of mask on clean skin, avoiding eye area, wait 15 to 20 minutes and rinse thoroughly with warm water. Use two to three times a week. Follow with moisturizer or night cream. If products get into eyes, rinse well with water. And the first, first, first ingredient in it is water, kaolin, talc, propylene, glycol. Wow. So where is collagen? Is like so far. Okay. Let's just get this mask to do what it's supposed to do. Please don't worry guys, I know I am anti face wipes, but these things are so gentle. I'm not even feeling anything, to be honest. Sometimes I take off my mask and I still have some in my nose for some reason, so <laughs> I just need to make sure that it's out of there. Because I have used a, a, quite, quite a few products that are uh, clay, uh, they need to stand dry, so I wanna kind of um, hydrate my skin. The thing with filming with natural light is that it's so unpredictable guys. So I have to hydrate my skin, so I'll be using the Clarins. Um, this is the mask, okay that's in fresh. This is the Hydra Quench uh, mask. It's a very creamy mask and I just love how it feels. 
so you see how creamy it is i really like the texture i just love using this after using my clay masks and stuff it feels really good i'm gonna leave that for a couple of minutes as well so so far you can count about three masks that i've done because it's sunday we have time okay where are we, where are we rushing to so it says five to ten minutes okay that's less time doesn't dry it stays it basically stays creamy like this the entire time that was the last of my masks um now i'm now gonna hydrate and moisturize and everything so i'm going to first begin with my evian um thermal water my skin is still damp but i just want to soothe my skin even more your product seeps in into your skin much better when you when your skin is damp so you don't need to apply uh, products on dry skin and actually it doesn't feel quite nice first i'm gonna put on my hydrating sun toner from mini soap and while i wait for all this to sip in and work i'm just gonna take my jade roller and i'm gonna roll upwards against gravity Facial mas massages, <laughs> facial massages are important to skin because they um, they help blood rush to your skin. They help relax your muscles. I don't know about you, when I sleep, I have my my teeth clenched together. It's like I sleep angry or something. So this actually helps my skin relax quite a bit, and I just really enjoy the feeling. And also, gel rollers they push your product into your skin. They help your products get into your skin. So you want to kind of get some sort of massage done for your face and massages will also keep you glowing and looking young for a while. Not forever, but for a while. And this is also deep puffing my skin. When I wake up in the morning, I'm quite puffy. So this helps my skin just kind of cool down and calm down, not be so excited. I spray a lot of stuff on my face, okay? I am going to spray my Mario Badescu uh, Facial Rose Spray. Uh, this one is just, I, I like the smell that it has and it's nice and hydrating and it's sort of like a toner as well so I'm just gonna spray some of that. So luxurious. Now I'm gonna go stand in front of my fan until all this is dry. <laughs> it's hot guys, there's no shame. Absolutely none. I'm gonna take my Clinique Moisture Surge. I've been sharing this with you guys for a while. I have been using it, I have been loving it. It's actually almost out. I get so excited when my products finish, guys, because I am one of those people who has so many products. I just wanna see it finished. So I'm just gonna apply that on there. This is also another one that hydrates. After this, I'm gonna apply my favorite eye cream. You guys know uh, this one from um, Clarins. I use this one quite a bit. You guys have seen me use it quite a bit. What I mostly like about this eye cream is this little part behind or at the other end that um, is like a facial massager or like an eye massager. I really like that so I'm just gonna take that and just massage underneath my eyes and this is also pushing in the eye cream into my skin so nice and cooling and to finish up my moisturizing I am going to use my Dermalogica uh, skin smoothing cream uh, which has become my everyday moisturizer actually and I am going to apply this on my face to protect my skin my sunscreen is the Eucerine SPF 50 you guys have seen me use it quite often I am going to take some of that and just apply this all over my face as well my face my ears my neck everywhere and just to finish off everything my egyptian magic for my lips so that's it guys this is basically what my routine looks like on a sunday what i do to my skin and stuff um especially when i have plans like today i have plans so i'm gonna go and join my family for, for sunday lunch i just need to tidy myself up before i leave the house so if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up if you have absolutely any questions please feel free to just comment in the comment section below please also feel free to share with anybody that you know anyone that would also like to watch this mini vlog uh, this mini skincare vlog just share it with them and don't forget to subscribe like and share so i'll see you guys in my next video bye bye